Hi everyone, this is Jerry with San Pedro Mastery. This video for a change is not about sacred cacti. It is about another sacred plant, Salvia divinorum. And the reason I'm posting this video is that my plant is really, really poorly. And I hope someone might be able to tell me what the problem is. As you can see, I had two plants before and they look great. I was happy because I started with some small cuttings that arrived in terrible condition in the post. It was a trade that I did with someone for some cacti. And that was not his fault that they arrived in bad condition. Just that the post took two weeks to deliver the packet. I managed to save the cuttings and then to turn them into these beautiful plants. I tried to grow them outside and I found it difficult to hide them enough from the sun. There is not much shade on my terraces. As you can see, the leaves here are a little marked by the sun. So I moved them inside the house where they seem to thrive in a place where there is no direct sun, but a lot of ambient light. The leaves were looking good, I think, and I never misted the plant, which many people like to do. Then I started to have some bugs on some of the leaves. I sprayed the underside of the leaves with soapy water and possibly neem oil, I can't remember now. And also, for a more systemic action, I watered the plant with tobacco infusion. It was the start of the growing season. It was a hot summer last year and I had to put the air conditioning on a lot of the time, including at night. The plant started to look worse and worse. Leaves were falling. Sections of the stalk started shriveling and dying. One of the plants died completely and now the one that is left is looking very poorly. I'm not sure if it can be saved. I certainly left it very late to ask for help, my fault. If you think you know what's happened to my plants, please let me know in the comment section below. Could it be the air conditioning? Could it possibly be tobacco mosaic virus from the tobacco I used as an insecticide? Could it be another virus passed on by some of the insects? Any suggestion would be of great help. Maybe this plant will die, but I would like to understand what was the cause of it before I try to grow salvia again. I know it is a difficult plant to grow, but I'm normally good with plants. Thanks everyone for watching, and if you are new to the channel, please check our other videos and tutorials all about growing the San Pedro cactus and the peyote. Bye for now.